Many years ago, everybody used to speak our language, but it's now down to about 60 speakers. The people of this community want the language to be alive. Kanatahawi Hilda Nicholas Yunjats, Wakiskere Wake, that Nukanisatake, what Jot de Wazio Serake, Ne, I do one who sate, Ne, Unguamona Kanyokeha. They are one is a rate, Yunjats, Kanazadage Rono, that no Kanazadage Ganata go, Kitero. Kade Wayasta Snake and Yakeha, I study Moak language here in Kanazadage. I find that language and culture. It goes hand in hand because through learning the language, you you are you get connected to your ancestors and your roots through these these words. I mean, some of these words that we learn could be thousands of years old. <laughs> People want the language back. They want it flourishing and being spoken again. It's very difficult to take everybody in with. Number one, our number one struggle is funding. I have a waiting list of about 20 young people who want to learn the language, but I am not able to give the service because there is uh, no funding. It just needs to be a, a priority. I mean, it, it's tied to who we are, and I think if people have the courage to do that, then um, hopefully others will follow. I feel lucky now that I'm, I'm one of the ones in the program. Just being here learning the language, I mean, it's, it's challenging, but um, you know, I feel good at the end of the day that I'm doing something. You know, we have, uh, I've been told, like 50 speakers left in our community. This is, this is really it for us. We have to learn the language. Like, there's no ifs, ands, or buts. Language is directly connected to our culture, which is directly, it's all entangled to our identity. And over the years, over several hundred years, a lot of, of efforts have been undertaken to eliminate these things, to separate us from our culture and our language. And I think the best thing we can do for ourselves right now to heal and to bring ourselves up and to rise, our, rise up from where we are to something better, I think is through learning our language. Oh, well.